the Bronx, I'm Pamela Morales. Missed out on Spirit Week? Don't worry, we've got a close look of all the events, activities, and rallies held. <laughs> on Monday, students participated in Bongo Ball Mania. This game required soft air guns and gear to protect from flying foam-like footballs. The object of the game is to take out all players of the opposing team. This activity started at 3 p.m. in the quad and ended around 9 p.m. On Tuesday, students got the chance to customize their own UTPA Spirit bracelet. It has, a, it has a range of um, factors that what people go to games, events, and things like that. But most important is that a lot of people work and go to school. So it's like, they, um, you know, like coming to events will take away from their studies or doing things like that. So they got to have that from pride. And I think that this year the university has like, you know, definitely grown uh, a lot more than that. On Wednesday, Career Services held a booth and a fair to inform students about the services they offer. That stereotype is people believe we get them jobs. We are an office that helps facilitate with job openings. It's not up to us to give them the job. They do have to qualify and interview properly. And we do all the trainings specified for that, but we can't give you a job just because you need one. Um, <laughs> Good idea, it gives the students uh, that are freshmen and sophomores the opportunity to see all the different majors that are available and give them a better feel of what they can go into and they may discover something that otherwise they never would have thought of. Students tend to wait till they're graduating or have graduated to see our office. But in reality, we tell freshmen and sophomores to take advantage. The reason in doing this is because it is a process. You do need to know what you want to go into and what you should be doing. A lot of companies are starting to look for students with experience. The best way to do that is to get an externship or an extra internship position. And that can start off as at your freshman. On Thursday, the UTPA pep band filled the quad with music. Cheerleaders and dancers also pumped up the crowd. It's a great event where we see a lot of our student athletes, but our regular students coming out in support of uh, just UT Pan American and all the events that are going on this week. You know, in addition to the Spirit Rally, we have the volleyball games and the mid opening the basketball season with Midnight Madness. So it's, it's great to see the enthusiasm that the students here at UTPA have for our university. fun um, this since I've been to Pan Am this is the first time I see so much spirit being incorporated in the university and I look Spirit Week ends with Midnight Madness held on Friday which is an event that kicks off basketball practice and the season stay tuned for the Pan American for full coverage on Midnight Madness for the Pan American I'm Pamela Morales.